Hello everyone and welcome back to GTA Online with Longclaw and Valerian Steel where we always deliver. This week Halloween fever reaches its peak with several strange happenings all over the state at once. Alien spacecrafts have been seen hovering mysteriously above several landmarks and the LSPD and the armed personnel have all been put on high alert. Residents have been told to stay in their homes. Stay tuned for more information. <laughs> Import and export work has been suspended for all businesses based at the Los Santos terminal today as armed police were called to the scene after several calls were made by dock workers reporting strange sightings and flashing lights hovering low over one of the dock warehouses. The Los Santos Police Department have now confirmed that multiple officers were injured in a fierce battle between what has been reported as extraterrestrial aggression. A farmhouse located in the Sonora Desert was today the scene of a gun battle between locals and what one eyewitness reports was a strange green man with a laser gun. Gunshots could be heard all around the 140 acre ranch just south of Grapeseed in the southeast of Blaine County. Several members of one local family have been reported to have been fatally injured in this conflict and once again several low flying aircraft were reported with flashing lights in the scene and around the area. Local state police have said that it is not yet clear where these visitors have come from, but have warned citizens of Los Santos and Blaine County not to approach as the green men are indeed hostile. Ignoring this warning, many of the citizens of Los Santos have been taking up their weapons and heading for the aircraft sites in an attempt to take out the invaders themselves, and Police County Sheriff Ayla Carlton has condemned this and this vigilante activity and asked citizens not to get involved. Fort Tancuda has been put on a full lockdown after three mysterious spacecrafts entered restricted airspace in the early hours of this morning. The Marine base was said to have responded with the full force in an attempt to prevent an attack by what one news channel is now calling alien invaders. Major Marek Crisp today reported that this was indeed one of several systematic attacks delivered by the invaders in different locations across the city and the state. Again, residents and locals were reported in the area as armed police, the LSPD and their armed forces wrestle to keep the state and the city under control at this time. The town of Grapeseed was today put on a red alert as state police and the FIB took to the streets in what has been called an epic showdown between one alien invader who took on multiple officers at the scene, injuring some and fatally wounding others. As the city and the state remain on high alert and lockdown, it cannot yet be established if full control will ever be regained. Several areas still remain in conflict and more sightings are being reported of the strange aircrafts every hour. The Marines, the FIB, the State Police and the LSPD have yet to respond as to the nature of the invaders' high-tech weaponry and the number of these invaders appears unclear as more have been reported to have been beamed down from the hovering spacecrafts to take the place of those who were shot down by local forces, making it impossible for the combined services and the intelligence services to regain control. The city and the state are now appealing for information in the comments below. Please support and like this channel to be kept up to date with this developing situation. Take care everyone, stay safe and happy Halloween. <laughs>